Courage the Radio Show. We're here on location at Cafe 50s with filmmaker Nick Murphy of Pizza and Bullets. And uh, this has been a crowdfunding uh, lunch today. I'm curious, why are you raising money for your film? Well, um, crowdfunding is, uh, I mean, I've never done that before in any film I've ever made. I've been, we've been making films since uh, I was 15 with my friends, and um, made almost close to 40 now. Uh, and uh, usually it's always been out of pocket. Um, there have been people who have donated their time, and there have been people who have given us like some, some really cool deals and locations and stuff, um, and props and whatnot, but it's all been out of pocket. I've never ever crowdfunded before. I've never had to ask for help or investors of any kind. Um, so what we decided to do was, uh, was this approach um, because I saw some I, I personally saw success through other filmmakers such as you guys, and, uh, and I said, well, you know what? If uh, a lot of my other friends can can pull this off, well, maybe we can too. And where are you right now for raising funds for Pizza and Bullets? We are, as of today, we are thirty percent funded. Um, we need 70 more percent uh, to go. Mm -hmm. By what date? A week and a half. A week and a half? Okay. okay. <laughs> it's not as if we started last week we thought, oh, let's put together this thing. This actually started three months ago. And we thought that um, it would be an easier sell because the film is not profit. And it's non-profit through something called Fractured Atlas, is that right? That is correct. Can you tell uh, us about that? Yeah, uh, Fractured Atlas is a nonprofit organization out of New York, and they sponsor the arts and artistic projects. And so, in order to get a, uh, approved for that, you have to apply for a fiscal sponsorship through them. And uh, when they approve you, um, then you are under their umbrella. So, when people donate, they're donating to the arts and to that organization on behalf of our film. Um, and so, that's what makes our film nonprofit. And so that counts as a tax deduction. The tax deduction is what my producer and I thought would clearly have $10,000 by June, three months ago, but it didn't quite work out that way. But we're very grateful for all the donations that we have so far, one day at a time. And uh, I understand that you need this money in a week and a half, you say, to be fully funded. When do you begin shooting? We begin shooting in a week and a half. Okay. <laughs> Um, so it's down to the wire. It's down to the uh -huh. wire. Uh, you know, we're doing the footwork. We're doing the best we can. And that's all that anybody can do. And, uh, you know, I'm just hoping that, that somehow a miracle happens. Uh, you know, I never rule out miracles. So we'll see. I mean, I don't want to dissuade anyone from, from donating. Um, but we're going to have to shoot in a week and a half regardless of how much money we have by then. Because, I mean, everything's locked. The crew and cast are, are, are ready to go. Uh, the locations have been deposited and paid for. I mean, we have been in, in pre-production for a year and a half, and we're ready to go. We're ready to make this movie. So it's just a matter of getting the money. We've got everything else we need, which is great, which is a blessing. So ready to make it, you know. 